Uh, let's get started with opening statements. The order was determined by a coin flip, which was won by Mr. Zioli, who has chosen to make his opening statement first. Mr. Zioli. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. I'd like to thank all of you for attending tonight and to the Chamber for sponsoring this event. It helps to uh, present my views and my knowledge on the town of Orange and many concerns also about the town of Orange to you this evening. When I took office, the town was in the best shape that it could possibly be, the state was in the best shape it could possibly be, and Washington, the entire country was. Times were lush, things were booming. Now we're probably in the worst possible times. Washington's not flush, Hartford's not flush, but the town of Orange is still surviving strong. Through this, I've been fortunate to have top quality businesses decide to come to Orange. They firmly planted their roots in companies like United Illuminating and Aurora Food Products are just to name two of those that will generate top tax dollars whether you measure it per square foot or per acre. They are the best tax generators the town of Orange is going to see. There are many things I'd love to continue, both construction, road repairs, drainage, school upgrades, or just to name a few. But when the economy is down and people are facing many challenges in their own personal lives and their trust is in me, it is not just seniors that are finding these problems. I've had young people in the office, I've had middle-aged people in the office, with oil at four dollars a gallon, electricity bills coming. We, are, we face some very serious challenges for people that are maxed out on cards and other debt. So, we all need to remember this and work tirelessly for the entire community and all the people that make up the town of Orange. I'd like to just let everybody know as part of this the Board of Selectmen that we've had for the last two years, since uh, November 2009, we've had 25 meetings. We've taken 204 votes. And out of those 204 votes, this is important for Mitch's two classes, they're welcome, I forgot to welcome both of those classes as well. There were 204 votes taken at those 25 Selectmen meetings, and all but six of those votes were unanimous. The Board of Selectmen, as it has existed for these two years, has been a seamless cooperation for the town of Orange. And I look forward to two more years of serving you. Thank you.